With the state of American men's tennis flatter than a crepe, it is notable to point out French men are in the midst of a, uh, how you say, renaissance. In Sacre Bleu, it's happening on American soil, not un American past the fourth round at the U.S. Open for the third year in a row, while France has run roughshod over the draw like Napoleon and a Peugeot down the Champs Elysees. The piece de resistance is this. Gail Monfils and Gilles Simon had a chance to put two Frenchmen into the quarters in New York for the first time this century. Monfils, the Prejean, taking on the seven seed Grigor Dimitrov. Heat was an issue in this one. Second set tied at four. Monfils down 40 love in this game. He's trying to conserve energy. He just literally gives the point away to Dimitrov. He was asked about it afterwards. Monfils admitted, it's nothing against anyone. I was upset. Later second set tied at five. Dimitrov in the far court serving, making Monfils work. Monfils would be upset after the point. He approaches the chair judge to complain about something falling from the ball boy's pocket. Take another look. This is what may have distracted Monfils. You see something appears to fall. We should point out Monfils, Monfils did not surrender. He kept playing. But anyway, second set tie break. Monfils down double set point. Mitrov said he defended when he had to, but if you think about it, I did a lot of unforced errors. Later in the tie break, set point now. Monfils watches it go long. He goes on to win in straight sets, 7-5, seven, 7-6, seven, 7-5. Seven, so the pressure on Gilles Simon facing the 14 seed Marin Cilic. In the fifth set, Cilic got on, cork the forehand winner down the line. Now, Simone rallied to beat Cilic at the Australian Open this year in five sets. He was 